KTM invites me for a press launch with the brand new Dukes and it was amazing. Beautiful sunshine, the asphalt was hot, so lots of grip with the 125 in the morning on the skate park, do some wheelies, do some stoppies and then full speed in corners with the 390 Duke back in the mountains and really uh, epic time with KTM and uh, yeah, it's a good break from the freestyle tour. So cool to ride the new Duke 125 through the city. We are just now in the in the skate park location. Show Mariana. Perfect playground for the 125 Duke. Got a cat. From the sky. Bene tu. Bene bene. That's arrows. The best camera guy in Italy. So I'm gonna show some stoppies for arrows. Let's do that. Showtime! <laughs> Showtime! Probably KTM will not admit, but they secretly programmed a stunt feature in this bike. I just discovered it. So for now I couldn't do any stoppies, but I find something. So you switch on the bike, you see the display, and then you go into motorcycle settings, and you switch off the ABS, and it says not legal, which, which means it's stunt ready. Yes! The new Duke has the jump feature also. Find it in the display. Because the Duke is a small beast, everybody wants to do burnout with this bike. Usually at the KTM they prepare lots of small details, just check this. That's what I call a spoon with style. So I can repair my bike and drink a coffee. Good job KTM. First stop. And what do you say guys? I love do, you, it. do you like the road? Oh yeah. it's perfect. Do you like the corner rocket that we call oh, it Duke 390? Yeah. It's amazing. Okay, good. Yeah. So thumbs up from the journalist and I cannot wait to continue the road because in front of us are mountains and millions of corners. In 2011 I saw the bike 
on Intermot in Cologne and it was amazing. The brand new design back in the day, something new. I saw this bike in the development department, the, now the new model a few months ago and now it's in the final stage and I'm so surprised. The, the engineers really took it to the next level and uh, the design, it's uh, amazing. It's, in my opinion, the coolest bike on the street. Lots of updates, better performance, better brakes, uh, lots of small details. So I can't wait to take this bike to my garage and transform it into a freestyle bike and ride it all around the world again.